let me show you how I upload a YouTube short. Okay, so let me go ahead and share my screen here. So I've already uploaded the video and you can basically upload your YouTube short via your phone and then process it on your computer later. I'm showing you on my computer or you can upload it from the computer, okay? So just to be clear, what becomes a YouTube short? It's a vertical video, a portrait mode, vertical video that is one minute or less. If you upload one of those, YouTube will automatically categorize it as a short. There's not even an option. It just turns into a short. If the video is not vertical, if it's landscape, like most Zoom, if you record video on Zoom, that's called a landscape video because it's horizontally larger than it is vertically, then it cannot be a short because it's not the vertical format. Okay, So it has to be a vertical format, it has to be one minute or less. So once you record it, most of the time, it's easier to do that via, via our phone. You just you know hold your phone like this vertically and record, record using the camera software and make sure it's under one minute and it's, it's gonna be a short. Okay, all right. So you can, like I said, you can upload it on your phone and then process the further steps on the computer or you can just do it completely through the phone. I've uploaded it on my phone and then here I am at the computer to do the final steps to just kind of show you what I'm doing here. So you should obviously title it. And these days, when you're, especially when you're on the computer, they have AI suggestions for hashtags. If you don't even have a, if you don't even have a, um, a title, I think they have, uh, I thought they had a suggested title, um, but anyway, I, they, they will at some point have suggested titles, not, not just hashtags. Um, should you have, should you use hashtags? In my opinion, yes. If you want to, if you think it helps, you could test it. I, I have tested it. I don't find hashtags to be enough of a reach growth for me to even worth the, worth the, you know, the half a minute and one minute. I'm probably just lazy. It's probably helpful. So whatever hashtags that give you, you really might want to consider it or you can, um, I think that's all they give you. They just give you three. So whatever. Okay. Further down in the description area, Anyway, I'm not going to go through all this. This is, I already made a video, uh, another video on my YouTube channel about how I upload a YouTube video. So this stuff is all the same. I'm not going to talk about that here. I'm going to keep it, this one shorter. Again, this is all the same as my other video about how to upload, how I upload YouTube videos. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to show you what's, what's unique to YouTube shorts. This one is unique. This one, a normal YouTube uploading um, doesn't have this screen. Uh, as of this time anyway. So only a short has a screen. So what, what you need to simply do here is scroll down all the way. I mean, I'm assuming you don't have inappropriate language. If you do, you have to say that you do. Okay. You have to, you have to, you have to make, make an option, but I don't, if you're making YouTube short, you might as well not cuss <laughs> unless that's part of your brand. Right. But anyway, there's no inappropriate language, no, ad no adult, there's no violence, nothing shocking that was disgusting or, or upsetting to viewers. Um, anyway, I'm going to go through all this. If you, you, you need to look at this yourself and see if you can, uh, honestly say, uh, no to all these, but, um, sensitive trot. <laughs> Sometimes I do talk about sensitive business things like funnels are bad. Maybe that's controversial and shocking to some, some business people. So I say none of the above. So you just simply scroll down, click none of the above, and then you may have to scroll up a little bit and click submit rating. Okay. So that's the unique part of uploading YouTube short. The, the rest is really the same. You click next again. This is similar to, um, you know, what what uh, the other. Actually, no, that's not true. I'm sorry. This is also unique to 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 YouTube Shorts. You can add a related video. So, in other words, once someone watches your YouTube Short video, they can then be suggested. YouTube will suggest, hey, you might want to watch this other video because it's related to to this YouTube Short. Usually, that means, hey, if you want more information or if you're really into this, watch the longer version or another ver a, lo a longer video. But that that's how I look at related videos. So I'm going to click Add here, and because my video, and you can basically click click here and search. I I'm talking about Energy Signature, so I'm going to search Energy energy signature and press enter, or I don't have to press enter. It just automatically takes a moment and it'll pull up. So I'm going to click here for the related video because I think that's related to, 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 to this one. Okay. And then sub subtitles, you click add. And basically, uh, I believe YouTube will, um, no. Okay. I'm sorry. At this time, YouTube still, uh, for, for YouTube shorts, it doesn't automatically subtitle it. 
uh, I think it'll, it's, I'm sure it's coming, but right now you would have to upload the file or type manually. It's, which is not a big deal. It's one minute long. So you might want to just listen to yourself and click type manually and say, all right, from, um, from one minute to, uh, to, you know, zero, uh, zero dot zero five, I said this, and then you, uh, I said this, you know, and then the next five seconds, you have to keep adjusting it, you know, 0 0.08, I said this, you know, whatever. Anyway, I'm not going to, I'm not going to do any, any of this right now for the sake of the video. I'm just going to X this out, discard changes, and I'm going to ignore that. Tag products, I'm going to ignore that right now. Click next. Okay, so that's fine. Click next, visibility. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and click publish right now. Um, actually, no, I'm going to publish this on Saturday. I no, I'm going to publish it right now, actually. So you can schedule it to be published or you can publish it right now. I didn't upload a video today, so I'm just, I'm going to make this my video of the day. Click publish. Oh, one more thing you might be wondering is, George, how do you change the thumbnail of a YouTube short? You, you cannot at this time. I'm guessing that they're going to see for now. You can't change the thumbnail. So I'm sure it's probably coming in the next six to 18 months, maybe. But right now you just have to go with whatever they, they automatically select. So just, you know, good, good luck with that. Anyway, um, click publish. Anyway, I'm not going to, I'm going to ignore this instant premiere thing for now. I, I don't find myself that important, my video. <laughs> but yes, if you don't mind, uh, you know, showing your audience, this is an instant premiere. This is that special, uh, whatever. You can check that if you want to. That probably does get a, a, a does get more views, but I'm, I, I, Part of my brand is trying to be more modest and humble. That's part of my brand. So I purposely don't do this kind of thing. So I click publish and that's it. That's how you upload. That's how I upload a YouTube short. If you have any other tips for others um, in terms of this process of uploading a YouTube short, feel free to comment below. Thanks.